Yo, what's going on you guys? It is JS here, back again with another video, and today we have some incredible, incredible news in today's video, and that is regarding the FNAF movie. So, as the time I am recording this video, we got some incredible news. So, first things first, before I even discuss anything, Jason Blum on his Twitter said this. As promised, hashtag FNAF fans, you asked and we delivered. Hashtag FNAF movie is coming this Halloween on October 27th, 2023. 205 days until the party, and that is the big news. He also adds on top of that, we will be getting this movie not only in theaters on that day, but also available on Peacock, which is pretty much what they did for both Halloween as well as Megan. But whenever Halloween released, that was free, but whenever Megan released, you had to pay for it. But I don't know. We'll see about that. But until the meantime, we got the news. Okay, so on the official Blumhouse Instagram, they posted this, and I'm going to read it to you guys, and then they have a teaser I want to share with you all. They said this. Universal Pictures will release Blumhouse's Finance of Freddy's on Friday, October 27, 2023 wide. The film will also premiere day and date with theatrical on Peacock about Finance of Freddy's. So this is the official like summary that they have for the movie. The terrifying horror game phenomenon becomes a blood chilling cinematic event as Blumhouse, the producer of Megan, the Black Phone, and the Invisible Man brings Five Nights at Freddy's to the big screen. The film follows a troubled security guard as he begins working at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. While spending his first night on the job, he realizes the night shift at Freddy's won't be so easy to make it. We have Josh Hutcherson from Ultraman, very much known in the incredible Hunger Games series. Matthew Willard, Good Girls. I'm gonna be honest, I never heard of that movie, but Scream. You guys are familiar with that one. Elizabeth Lale, you, Mac, and Rita, Cat Connor Sterling, We Have a Ghost 911, Piper Rubio, Holly and Ivy, Unstable, and Mary Stewart Masterson, Blind Spot, and Fried Green Tomatoes. And she was also a really big star in the 80s and 90s. Finance of Freddy's is directed by Emma Tamey, The Wind, Blood, Moon, and is written by Scott Cawthon, Emma Tamey, and Seth. Cutback. The film's iconic animatronic characters will be created by Jim Henson's Creature Shop. And then Finance Price is produced by Jason Blum and Scott Coffin. The film's executive producers are B. Securia, Russell Binder, and Christopher H. Warner. Universal Pictures presents a Blumhouse production in association with Striker Entertainment. Hashtag FNAF. It's so amazing. I'm. Whenever I first saw that, my mind just exploded. And I just, I just said it everywhere on social media. It's, it's incredible that so many years later, we are going to be getting this incredible film. And I cannot wait to see it in theaters. This is going to be a truly epic experience for everyone, especially, you know, us FNAF fans. It's, it's going to be absolutely incredible. And I cannot wait to see what Scott has to offer, Jason has to offer, Emma Tamey has to offer, as well as the whole entire cast and crew of this movie. And oh my god, man, I'm I'm so ready. October 27th, 2023. Oh boy. Save your calendars, you guys. Save your calendars because this is going to be an epic journey. Now, before we end off this video, I do want to talk about the teaser that they put up as well. So if we go onto the teaser, as you can see right here. This is the front of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, but with, it looks like Freddy Fazbear, or it might be Golden Freddy, but from this it looks like Freddy. And then also this looks like Piper Rubio's character, which is going to be Abby. Now, what I want to point out is that Abby is holding hands with Freddy. Now, I don't know if this is a very significant part of the movie that's gonna connect with the plot, Gregory and Glamrock Freddy vibes, uh, because they worked so closely together in Security Breach, and that's kind of kind of giving me the vibe that it has right now, but it's really sweet, and I absolutely love that. It kind of does, you know, give me that vibe of it, and of course, they are outside the ruined part of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, 
with the glorious sign that is made outside and then with the exterior as well which was shot here in new orleans and it's just absolutely incredible and i love love this image that they showed right here yeah that is going to be it for this video please let me know your guys' thoughts about this in the comment section below i would love love to hear about your guys' thoughts and of course you know your thoughts about you know the movie release date this teaser whatever you guys have leave it down in the comment section below i'm going to read every single one of it but yeah, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys have enjoyed. And if you guys did, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. Make sure to subscribe for more videos. I'll see you guys till then. Peace.